What is masculinity? If we don't have a proper model for what masculinity is, then our society will continue to raise boys to be girls. And boys won't know what it means to be a man. So we're going to get either overly aggressive males or checked out males. But we don't want that. We want fully engaged, masculine, and virtuous men. This is the model that's super clear for me. I hope it is for you too. King, warrior, magician, and lover. This is part one of a video series introducing these four archetypes. First, the king. This is the man who has integrity. He protects and provides. He maintains order. And if there's chaos, he makes peace. The king inspires. He blesses the lives of others around him. And the king leaves a legacy. If a boy is not properly mentored and led to this ideal, then he will instead fall into the shadow archetype of either the tyrant or the weakling. The tyrant doesn't seek to bless others, he seeks to destroy. He exploits people for his own gain and he'll do anything to get ahead. Or the man's a weakling, doesn't take responsibility, doesn't make decisions, he's a pushover, doesn't stand up for himself or for those he loves and those who rely on him. This man's insecure. They're both insecure. The major problem with our feminist culture is we don't try to turn boys into men. And if we don't intentionally turn boys into kings, don't be surprised when we get tyrants and weaklings. We're going to go over the warrior and the magician and the lover over the next couple of days. Please share this video and stay tuned.